Hi, I'm Grant from Gen Learn Automotive Products and today I'd like to answer some of the frequently asked questions that we get about the Rostec VCDS PC packages. Now the first question is what are the current VCDS interfaces that Rostec have on the market? Now Rostec have two interfaces. The first is the HEX V2 interface. Now that's a USB wired interface. And then you also have the HEX NET interface, which can be used USB wired or uh, Wi-Fi. So what is the difference between the HEX V2 and the HEX NET interface? Well, the HEX V2 is the USB wired interface, which replaces the older HEX USB plus CAN interface. And the HEX NET is the new USB wired or Wi-Fi interface. So the HEX NET is quite clever. You can use this in four different ways. You can either use it directly wired to a laptop as you would normally, or you can use it wirelessly between the car and the laptop. You can actually get it so it will set it so it broadcasts its own Wi-Fi network, which will mean you can do a quick auto scan on a mobile phone uh, or an iPad. Or finally, you can actually enter your garage or workshop Wi-Fi details into the HexNet. It will connect to your garage network, and then you can access it from the VCDS software on any PC throughout your workshop. Right, so what are VIN limits and what do they mean? Well, the new Rostec interface range has got various different VIN limits going from 3 VIN up to unlimited. Now the VIN limits are the number of vehicles that you can work on with that particular interface. So things like reading a fault code or clearing fault codes or looking at live data, they're, they're, they're free. You can do that as many times as you like on, on any of the interfaces. But if you want to do something more in depth, such as a service light reset, parking caliper wind back, or uh, throttle body alignment, you will need to actually store that VIN or the chassis number of that vehicle as one of the vehicles in your interface. Now, if you've got a three VIN interface, that means you can only store three cars, so three VINs in that particular interface. If you've got a 10 VIN, then that will allow you to do 10 VINs. Or your next one up is the unlimited where it doesn't count VINs and you can do as many different vehicles as you like. Now there is an upgrade path to go from a 3 VIN to a 10 and a 10 to an unlimited. So if you have a 3 VIN and you use up all those VINs, the interface isn't useless. You can just pay the upgrade fee, which is currently £169, and move up to the next level. So if you've got any other questions or would like to know anything else about the VCDS diagnostic software, please just give us a shout at Gendan Automotive Products. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.